Take a look. Oh. I want to ask you ladies, do you know where Dubai is? Where is Dubai? Where is Dubai? <laughs> no, you don't know yet. Huh? Like, you hear about it. There's Dubai. <laughs> I'm going We've to never Dubai. Been there. <laughs> you have no idea where we it is. No, no idea. No clue. No, no you clue. You want to a holiday to Dubai one day. Number one question. Do you even know where Dubai is? Yes. Uh, I work for this company. Okay. Dubai. Oh, okay. Fantastic country. Have you been there before? No, but good people who come from there. So, Mabel, we're doing a little uh, expose, uh, research on Dubai. Where is Dubai? Do you know? I don't know where Dubai is. We're doing an expose on Dubai. Do you guys even know where Dubai is? It's just there. Ah, yes, sir. Where is it? Oh, in the UAE. Okay, so have you been there before? Uh, no, I have not. A lot of women seem to, on Instagram, be able to afford to go to Dubai first class, get there, stay at these seven-star hotels. How do they afford this? How? Oh, that's a good question. Maybe they have blessed us. Yeah. 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 I want you to say the same thing. Is it blessers? <laughs> yeah. Are these, so. are these South African blessers taking them to Dubai, or are these Dubai blessers inviting them there? Dubai blessers. Really? And it is South African. Maybe our dad. I don't know. Maybe my dad is a blessing. <laughs> Why do you think so many women are going to Dubai. In a place. Yeah. Are the blessers there or are they here taking them to Dubai? No, they're here no. taking them to Dubai. What's happening in Dubai? The men there have money. Why do you think so many girls go there? That's where the money is at, right? They want to live their best lives. Really? <laughs> is it fair to label these ladies who go to Dubai and give them names like or prostitute, uh, no? no They're nice. just having fun? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. They and say it's very wild class to So if you can come say Dubai, yes, let's go, babe. <laughs> Why would they fly you guys up all the way from South Africa? Why not just have a companion from Dubai? Because our company is that good. And then we African are just... woman use the best, like, asset wise, paid hourglass money. That's us. That's right. African. What is the most extravagant thing you've gotten from a trip to Dubai? Yeah, I'd say I got these girls done. So that's why I'm just trying they to look, help They look them. so natural. They look very natural <laughs> because they're from Dubai. What's the craziest thing that has surprised you that you've had to do on a trip to Dubai? It's something that she made me do. Which is? How would you tell them? Huh? So you <laughs> made me do it. <laughs> to welcome me. Okay, what happened was, she's never had a threesome. Oh, like, never. Yeah, like, I never. She, so she was girl. just, she's yeah. more than, no, I was, I'm here to twerk, and I met her, get the money and go, and I'm like, mm, there's more to this. Like, yo, try a new thing, <laughs> let's explore. And what was that like? It was. <laughs> it was awkward at first, and he yeah. was like, you know, as time went on, it was, it was great. What is the biggest amount of money you've come home with from a single trip to Dubai? I'd say close to a So a million rand. rand. And how many days was this trip? How many days? It was a weekend. Just a weekend, two days. Wow. <laughs> and you? The the person is, the more they pay. <laughs> right. And, and for you? Close to that amount. Just close by. Why not just move to Dubai? Why live in South Africa and fly back and forth then? That's the piece of both worlds. Sucking money here, sucking money here. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, awesome. ladies, thank you so much for talking to us and clarifying this for us. Thank you so much for having me. Dubai, a whole new world. <laughs>